Hello. How do you, right? We are currently at our final market of the year, which we'll cover in the video next week. Next week. But hopefully, I've got a quick chance to put this week's one together and get it up for you. How are we doing? Nice to see you. Nice to have you along. If you haven't joined us before, I'm Natasha. And that's Paul. And we live in our 57 foot narrow boat full time. Work from it as well. Paul paints canal art. Don't be good. I make macrame and we sell canal and eco-friendly cleaning products, refillables. Canal cleaning products? Cool. I like that. Canal friendly. Oh, right. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, my eyes do keep darting the other way because I'm just watching our stall whilst we're doing this. We're busy today, but that's next week's video. It has been good so far, yes. So this week's video, you went off to learn some new skills, didn't you? I believe so, yes. Doing some sign writing. We had a day out with some friends. Uh, yeah, banger racing. And we've got a really exciting new business opportunity. We're teaming up with Camden Narrowboats and Canal Association. They contacted us off the back of the post last week and have asked us for some of Paul's canal art to go on the boat. Oh, yes. But which, that's, that's next week, isn't it? Which they're going to sell and obviously have permission towards the... Just going to go to the shop. Push that button, ring that bell. It's free to you, the world, and everybody down here at the market. I'll carry on. In a minute. <laughs> Um, so yes, obviously Topoli are going to have some commission off of the sales to go towards their charity. We'll tell you more about their charity later in the video. It's really exciting because they're talking really long term. So they do trips from the Canal Museum in London at King's Cross. Various length trips, corporate trips, public trips that can be booked currently through Welcher. They're looking at going to the group on. Um, like I say, we'll give you more information about that later in the video. So enjoy. I'm going to go and help as well. It's getting busy on the stall now and we'll catch you later. Morning. How are we? All right. Well, I've just been dropped off by Tash because I've got a day out today and I'm not painting on our boat. But what I'll do is I'll show you around in a bit. So we're down at Spiderworks with Colin. Colin we saw the other day. Do you remember? Well, after going to Crick, Colin turned around and said, come and see me. So I'm going to see him. Sign writing. Let's see whether we can learn something new. See whether he's in. So there you go. That's where we are. Colin Dundas, sign writer and boat painter. See you in a bit. So that is one of the next projects of Colin. And I know this because I know the boat and I know the owners. So that'll be nice to see next year because I believe it's having a complete remake because they're going to be out on the markets with us down south next year so keep your eye out. why the mole stick comes in so bloody handy because of what how it moves if you like I don't actually I become sort of quite subconscious of it the way it, it moves um, but you'll notice it goes in and out and swivels around and does all sorts of things So this is uh, some work I've done courtesy of Colin giving me some pointers and that's what I did when I originally started. So Tash has dragged me out, she's just in front of me <laughs> and uh, as you heard the chuckles. Um, but we're out for the day. She's treating me to some fun. Catching up with Natasha and Martin off one of our many customers 
but I'll show you what we're coming to. Pop over the top of this car and back of the van. Race tracks! Bang a racing. So, bang a racing. And it gets wild and wacky. And just negotiating the steps. But it's going to be a fab day out. We'll go and catch up with Tasha Martin. We've turned around and learned a little bit more how to do Q's, A's, I's and shadowing. This is the first proper beautiful frosty morning we've had this season, isn't it? I thought you were going to say the first morning we've had together. <laughs> well, we don't get many of them either. How are you doing? All right? We're out the door early, as you can see by how frosty it still is in the background. And yes, in those two bags, Excitingly, it's some stock to take somewhere. So, Join us on an adventure today. Yeah, we're going on a trip. We'll take you with us and show you different points along the way. First one, up the hill to the van. Yeah, and then huffing a bit. It. <laughs> so we're at Linslade still, and then a steep hill down to the moorings by the Globe Pod. And it was sub zero temperatures last night. This piece of road doesn't get gritted, <coughs> so I left the van at the top when I got home late last night, just in case it was a bit too icy for driving as well. Well, the Ocado van got stuck in a ditch the it other did. day. It did, so rather than the stress and the worry of getting up an icy hill, I parked at the top, hence out of breath. Come and join us for a day of adventure, see what we get up to. Nothing goes to plan. Well, yeah, delays. <laughs> So we couldn't park at Watford Station on the Metropolitan Line because the car park was full. So we drove to the next one which is Croxley and we parked there. And then there was delays due to cancelled trains. But we're here. We've just come out of St Pancras Underground. Have you got the bags done? Have I got the... The bags? You've got them. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're heading down towards London Canal Museum and Camden Canal Association. Boom. We've reached our destination. More to come in a bit. Here we are. We are inside Tapoli. And look what's hanging up. And that side. And on the shelves. So lucky people that are doing trips over the next few weeks coming up to Christmas can purchase some of Paul's canal art. We have also, of course, bought a supply of his baubles because they are proving so very popular. They can be purchased on the day and the rest can be ordered through the website. I'm Marcus. I'm the chair of Canby Canal Narrowboats Association and we run the boats after it. So we're hoping to do a lot of work together in the future and help promote each other. Obviously Topoli are going to have some commissioning off of the sails that go on the boat. And we are going to be at the cavalcade together in May as well. So it's all exciting stuff coming up and we will keep you posted. This is the picture Marcus sent when he finished decorating the boat. Camden Canals and Narrowboat Association is a registered charity which is run by volunteers. Tarpauli is a historic boat built in 1937 and she is used for boat trips for helping to improve people's mental health and also other community organisations and private bookings can be made. She accommodates 12 people and is also used for short holidays for people with mental health issues as well. We'll put the website details below. A percentage of Paul's Canal art sold on their trips will obviously go towards the charity. That's it, business part of the day done. Now for meal, dinner. Very successful meeting. I think so. Very exciting prospects ahead. 
have to watch this space and see what's it all about. Oh, you've done that, haven't you? Yeah, I've done that on the boat. <laughs> he didn't come on the boat with me, did he? No, I was taking pictures <laughs> ready for when I need to repaint it. So now it's off to Soho to our favourite pizza place, Rudy's. Can we mention the names? Yeah. Okay. We're not the on the BBC, we're fine. The brother in law. We're going to go and meet my brother. Have a nice one. See you in a bit. The joys of tube travelling. <laughs> Like we said earlier, we've left our van at Foxley. We're just trying to get back there. Two. Is only going as far as two stops before we need to be. Because apparently there's a bus leaving. So we need to work that now. We're going to walk back. Or we should have jump on a bus. We'll see. Hello, we hope you enjoyed that. I did, again. Well, the end of the day, so I haven't managed to put the video together yet, but hopefully we will do when we get back to our Airbnb in a bit and we can get it out this evening. Excellent. Well, you know what? I've enjoyed this week. <laughs> what, all painting on those baubles? Well, <laughs> just going to see the banger recently. Yeah, yeah it, was, it was good. good video. Yeah. So, yes, next week's video, we'll cover the Christmas markets and there's a really good community project going on here on the section of Kennet and Avon near Bradford and Avon so we found out about that today and we'll include that in next week's video there you go so push the button ring the bell it's free to you the world and everybody here at, on the Kennet and Avon and uh, we'll see you again next week but don't forget <laughs> yeah I will put the link for our website below in case you do want to order anything for Christmas, but get your orders in quick because the cut-off is the 7th of December. There you go. But if you've got a friend who's interested, please share us and care us. Because you know what? Our adventures get us to the most weirdest, different places going. But... We'll see you next week. Have a good one. Take care. See you later.